Memorial Day to me is about the value of sacrifice and remembering those that paid that ultimate price in defense of our country. It's a day to remember. It's a day to remember all the sacrifices that every man and woman has given for this country. Many people think that Memorial Day is the start of summer, or it's a barbecue holiday, it's a day off of work. The real meaning of Memorial Day is to celebrate and to honor the lives of those that have paid the ultimate sacrifice so that we could have those barbecues and enjoy the weekends with our family. Memorial Day can be for anybody, um, whether it's police, firefighters, you know, veterans that have paid the ultimate sacrifice, but even victims and families of 9-11. You know, However you want to memorialize somebody or a group of people, that is what this day is for. So to be here at Arlington Cemetery, there's over 400,000 grave sites here. A few minutes ago, we walked by a Medal of Honor recipient who jumped on a grenade to save his buddies. It's humbling, it's surreal, and it really helps to put things in perspective. Who do I think about on Memorial Day? Three Marines, Sal Bashar, Ricky Lott, Cole Alexander, some of the best men I've ever had the privilege of serving with. The very first supervisor I had in the Air Force, Tech Sergeant Brian Badstibner, actually passed away this year in the line of duty left behind family and children and it's really hits you in the in the gut when, when something like that happens. This Memorial Day I plan on like reflecting on like his sacrifices, his life and how he helped me grow in, in my service. On Memorial Day in particular, I always like to remember Lance Corporal Edward Dykus. He gave his life for our country on my first deployment to Afghanistan in 2012. So every Memorial Day he's always in my heart and in my mind. It is truly a bittersweet holiday because I've had several friends that aren't here with us today. A good friend of mine, uh, Salem Bashar, uh, lost him 10 years ago in 2006. And I also think about Sergeant Major Cottle. He was just someone that I admire, and he was just one of those guys that you would do anything for. I like to look at Memorial Day as an opportunity to celebrate their life and to make sure that I'm living in a way that honors their sacrifice. I love the fact that people can spend their longer weekend with friends and family, celebrating, grilling, all that fun stuff. But at the same time, taking moments throughout that day to truly appreciate those that came before us and gave us the ability to have weekends like that. Yeah, I encourage you to enjoy the day, but it is nice to just re reflect on you know, the people that have made the ultimate sacrifice.